What happens when you take a save file from Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and put it in Let's Go Pikachu? Well, today I'll be figuring that out because I'm going to be using some game modification tools to back up my Pokemon Let's Go Eevee save file and bring it into my Let's Go Pikachu game. Warning, the results are pretty entertaining. Alright, Pokemon, let's go Pikachu version with my Eevee save file, and right away, that's a pretty fancy haircut you've got there, Mr. Pikachu. I didn't do that to you. Looking at Pikachu with this hairstyle, I feel like he'd get pretty upset if I even tried touching his hair. He'd probably be like John Travolta in Saturday Night Fever going, Hey, don't touch the hair! Be careful with the hair! I worked hard on that! We just washed the hair! It looks good on you, Pikachu, don't worry. Alright, now this is the weirdest thing. So we get in the game, we still have Eevee on our head even though we're playing Let's Go Pikachu, but if you open up the menu, it says play with Eevee and shows the Pikachu icon. And it gets even better because if you open it up, listen. My poor Eevee is so confused, it thinks it's a Pikachu. Every time you play with it, it starts going, Pika, Pika, Pika! <laughs> it's so cute, but it's also so confused. I feel so bad. It's like the Eevee that always wanted to be a Pikachu, but couldn't be. Okay, now it hates me. Probably because I made it into a Pikachu. Anyway, let's go to Cerulean City. I want to see if it can learn Pikachu's exclusive move. What? Where's the partner Pikachu coming from? That's so weird. I don't have partner Pikachu, I only have the Eevee. That's so, so strange. But I want to try teaching it Pikachu's exclusive moves and see if that'll actually work. Or if it's still going to be the Eevee moves. Let's try talking to this guy. Hey, you! Do you want me to teach a marvelous move to Eevee? Yes, of course I do. Oh, sweet! So it can learn Zippy Zap, Floaty Fall, and Splishy Splash. Let's try it. I'm going to teach it all three moves. We're going to try these out in battles. So as usual, we're gonna go visit my buddy, Camper Shane, over here. I like to battle him whenever I'm doing some weird stuff in the game. He's probably sick of seeing me again. Every time he sees me, he's probably like, Oh, it's you again. You're gonna do something weird to me. This time, we've got our little confused Eevee here that thinks it's a Pikachu. So we're gonna see what it looks like when Eevee uses Pikachu's special moves. Go on out, Eevee. Go on out, do your thing. <laughs> Let's try using- Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. So we're seeing that little shaky icon up there showing the Pikachu. Will something special happen if I try doing that? Eevee sure hit move. What? <laughs> I think V Volley is its normal special move. I think. But that's weird how it showed Pikachu's little animation. Alright, we gotta find somebody else to test out the new moves that I taught it. This poor Oddish is about to get Zippy Zapped out of existence. Let's do it. Eevee used Zippy Zap. <laughs> that's so funny. Every single time hearing Eevee just say, Pika! It's like the story of the Eevee that wanted to be a Pikachu. Alright, what should we try next? Let's try a uh, Splishy Splash. Let's do that. Oh, it's gotta do quick attack. It's gotta go first before me. Get that one damage in. Ooh! Woo! Look at that! The Surfing Eevee! I love that! That looks so cool! Let's do that one again. I wanna try Splishy Splash again. Alright, Eevee use Splishy Splash. Oh, that looks so cool. I wish he got a Surfboard normally. That's so unfair that Pikachu gets a surfboard, but Eevee doesn't. Anyway, I think Eevee's a little bit better. Don't hate me. <laughs> Alright, now let's try that last move. Let's try, uh, Floaty Fall. Eevee used Floaty Fall. Ooh, look at those balloons. <laughs> so that's funny. Those moves, every single time you use it, it automatically has, like, Pikachu's cry in there. So I'm assuming if you gave these moves to, like, any other Pokemon, they would also start going, Pikachu! Pikachu! So I wanted to see if I could make Pikachu wear Eevee's exclusive clothing, however the game just won't let you put it on, and even if you do back up your save with your Eevee already wearing the exclusive clothing, it won't show up on the Pikachu. That's okay though, because there's no way in the world I want to put a hat over Pikachu's beautiful hairdo. And even though I'm using my Let's Go Eevee save file in my Let's Go Pikachu game, I'm still only finding the Let's Go Pikachu version exclusives in the wild. That makes sense because the version exclusives are tied to the game, not the save file. Also, something I realized is every time you battle your rival now, you're gonna have the same Pokemon that they do, you know, until they get to evolve their Eevee and you can't do anything with yours. And even in the cutscenes, it still sounds like a Pikachu. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. This is the funniest way to just play your Pokemon game. 
Well, I think that pretty much covers all the weird things that'll happen when you play a Let's Go Eevee save in your Let's Go Pikachu game. Thanks a bunch to Eurobenzin on Twitter for suggesting this video to me. It was a lot of fun to make. If you guys enjoyed watching all this silliness and nonsense, give this video a thumbs up because it really helps out the channel. And if you guys have any more suggestions for weird things you want me to do in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, let me know down in the comments section below. As always, thanks for watching, and guys, I'll be seeing you in the next video. Take care.